you, what would you say to an executive with no cannabis experience that wants to get in now? Let, let's just hypothetically say we were interviewing, I don't know, a CFO candidate for, for, for a cannabis company and they're coming from uh, Nike. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What would you tell him? What would, him or her? With, I, three things. It's a great question. And, and if I told myself, or we'll just use me seven years ago, um, the, we've already talked about this. Be humble. Always be a learner. Yep. Be a learner. Don't, don't, it's different. Be humble. Go in there and learn. You're, you're first and foremost a student. And I would recommend anyone get out into the grow operation or the retail operation mm. or the extraction operation. Go work there for a week. Go work there for a week. It'll do wonders. Mm -hmm. um, we, have a, we had a grower at Mindful. He still tells everyone that starts coming. He goes, you wouldn't believe it. Tom was out here for like two weeks, like, Getting wet and plants around. They, they wanted me to get the hell off the floor, but but I'll tell you what, I walk a mile in their shoe. Be humble. So number one, yeah. and a learner. Um, number two, don't just because it's cannabis, I call it business physics. The physics, gravity on this planet we live on is the same for you and me, Steve. I can't <laughs> and the same thing with the certain things in business that count. Cash flow is important. Cash flow is king. It's, it's oxygen, right? Without cash flow, it's oxygen, right? That's right. Those physics still apply. Just because it's cannabis doesn't mean the laws of business or the rules of business, and I'm, there's no laws, but you know, the laws yep. of physics still apply to you. Gravity's that's gravity. Right. It's still the same gravity, you know, for Tom as it is for somebody that's been in cannabis for 10 years. So don't, that basis you learn, that, that business experience you have with dealing with people and balance sheets mm -hmm. and financial statements, the, those rules still apply. Those rules still apply. That's right. Yeah. And then the final <laughs> thing is, and I just used that quote, it's about Mattis, right? In cannabis, you're going to see some things that you've never seen. Even now, the business has grown up a little. Be prepared. Be prepared. Stay true to your values. What are you prepared to say no to? Mm, that's a great one, Tom. I think we, that, you know what I mean? I just saw one. that one, Stephen. It really encapsulates for me because I've always been prepared to what I'll say yes to, but I never think in a negative context, mm. not negative, but, but a counter, you know, a, a, a mm. negative, meaning a film that, the opposite of that. What will I, what am I willing, what am I absolutely, what am I non-negotiables? Mm, I love that. Tom. So I'd what happens? Be humble, be a learner. Business physics still apply. Um, don't let anyone, you'll come in and say, oh, it's not that way in cannabis. My answer to that is bullshit. A balance sheet is still a balance sheet and a, and a, and a p and is still a p &L. And then the final thing is just be prepared. Know, know where you'll draw that line. Where yeah, I like your, that. Your personal system what you'll say no to, what you, you know, you'd be willing to say yes to.